what's up ladies and gentlemen welcome back to some more assassin creed 3 with your boy card and scott aka card dizzle continuing directly where we left off at sea in atlantic ocean with my uh boat buddies they can be uh real mean sometimes but hey i get over it they can be assholes but I overlook it because I'm a professional, so here we go. I guess he was uh, trying to figure the necklace out or something. Atlantic Ocean, day 28. Mr. Kenway. Captain. Whatever they're up to, I believe it's coming to a head. I'd best get to work. Okay. Something, uh, somebody's, uh, conspiring against us, so. We gotta find out the truth. He's over here. You there. I have some questions for you. That's nice, but I ain't got time to gossip. Probably wouldn't have anything useful to share anyway. You want information? Try the cook or the doctor. Everyone's always chatting them up. Okay. The cook or the doctor. talk to this guy first what the hell are they doing <laughs> wow getting better boys keep it up keep it up dance together look homoristic it's beautiful Come with a question. What's that? Have any of the men been acting strange recently? Said anything that struck you as out of the ordinary? The boys cry about the rations as if there's anything I can do about it. But beyond that, I ain't heard much. My advice? Go find James. His ears are always open. And where might I find him? Right behind you, actually. He's the one sitting on the barrel. Keep uh, giving me the turnaround. Are you James? Hi, Nathan Kenway. Pleased to meet you. I know who you are. I was hoping you could answer some questions. I figured as much, but not here. Follow me. So, what do you want to know? Have you seen or heard anything out of the ordinary since we left port? Anything that gives cause for concern. Some of the men have been gathering at night on the upper deck. I've only caught bits of their conversations, so I couldn't say for certain what they're up to. But I suspect it bodes ill. Is it a mutiny they're planning? All I know is they have little love for the captain. Mills has been trying to talk him down, but there's only so much one man can do. Thank you for the information. I only wish to see us reach the colonies alive. Hmm, okay. 
I would like to uh, see the colonies alive myself. That would be nice for a change. Okay. What the? Evening, sir. How are things? Calm and quiet. Just the way I like it. What brings you topside? Thought I'd wander a bit. Stretch my legs. That's all. Say, care where you tread. The deck hides all manner of danger in the dark. What was that? Someone's throwing cargo overboard. But why? Hmm. Very curious. Let's go, uh, see who's throwing this cargo overboard. It's a little suspicious to me. Something's going on. Claims we're not provisioned for such luxuries. It's not like you should face the lamb and wine. Okay. Barrel. Ocean day thirty three. Something suspicious going on on the boat, so we're gonna have to uh, find out and uh, investigate what the hell's going on. Any news? Each night it's the same. I scout one area and they drop the painted barrels from another. I'm going to need to recruit an extra pair of eyes. Maybe James or Mills. Why are they doing this? Near as I can tell, the barrels serve as markers. They're leaving a trail. My fear is it's only a matter of time before whoever's following it. Ship sighted aft! She's making ready to fire! Beat to quarters, men! Ready the. Brace! Everybody down! A warning shot! Seems they don't mean to sink us, but board us instead! Man the cannons! Make ready to fight! I want you below decks! Why? Let me help you secure the ship. Do you know how to rig a sail? To load a cannon? To wage war at sea? I didn't think so. Now return to your cabin, or do I need to have you escorted? topside. Our ships appeared in means to board us. It's strange. There's no sign of mutiny aboard. It doesn't make sense. Ah, but it does, Simeon. Did you think you could escape from London so easily after what you did at the opera? That we wouldn't notice? That we wouldn't follow? Ah. So that's what this is about. Surrender, and I will see that you are treated with honor. If you wish to treat me with honor... Give me a sword. Are you sure this is how you want to play it? Uh-oh. Looks like we about to have a showdown. <laughs> Man, look at that uh, trail behind the sword. That's dope. Okay. Let's boogie. Oh. Pick up 
pick up your sword, newbie. Oh! <laughs> I told you to stay below decks. I did as you asked. Only Mills was there waiting for me. He's the one that drew that ship here. There was no mutiny. Only him. What do they want? Me. Then they can have you. Is that so? You'll catch us anyway. There's nothing to be done. I can think of something. You wish us to sail into the storm? It's our only chance. I won't do it. Then I will. All right. All right. storm. ship don't fall apart oh god look at that wave Ugh. oh man that looks scary shoot oh god see that's why I don't like the ocean I really don't okay, let's tighten this rope up Oh, snap. I got it. Ah, I got it. I got it. Oh, God. I, I, I got it. Oh, God. I got it, man. Ugh. Oh, snap. Oh, God. Ah, all right. Whoa. Oh, God. Whoa. That bounced me up. <laughs> oh, that scared me. Oh, snap. <laughs> oh, snap, man. <laughs> if that was real life, I would have screamed though. It threw me like hella high up in the air. Thank God I landed back. Oh snap. Got hit by some damn lightning. Oh snap. Oh. Hang on. I'm coming. It's okay. I got you. Hang on. Whoa. Oh, man. Oh, snap. Well, looked like they did make it. That's a good thing. They didn't even make it, so, uh, we're fine. Yep, look at that. Made it out the storm. Badass. Atlantic Ocean, day 72. Coerce soldiers, soldiers of the sea. We will make it do anything. Work in unity. But yeah, that was a uh, very epic and interesting. It had to be the first psycho idea of the cell into a storm. Go towards the storm, not away from it. Hmm. He must have seen something. Alright. Let's go investigate what he saw. Damn. Everybody all tired and messed up. The boat is all out of place down here. Yeah. 
people all of it right now. Okay. Let's get up out of here. Get get caught uh claustrophobic. Messing up on my words these days. Make ready for our arrival, men! Arrival? I see no land, only this interminable fog. The gulls tell us all we need to know. Climb into the crow's nest and you'll see. Okay. Yeah, Nathan. Oh, okay. My bad. <laughs> Wrong way. Uh, you can climb up, my friend. Thank you. I love how uh, detailed this ship is. It's awesome. Alright. Damn, it's high. The New World. Assassin Creed 3. Beautiful. Journey to the New World. Which it is. <laughs> that was beautiful. Now, y'all can't tell me that was the most amazing intro ever for this game. That was beautiful. It was just like a, a awesome-ass Three Musketeer movie, how the title first come on. You know, just... You know, it's just beautiful. I just love how epic it was. Just grabbed your soul. Boston, 1754. Master Kenway. Master Kenway. Yes, may I help you? Charles Lee, sir. A pleasure to make your acquaintance. I've been asked to introduce you to the city, help you settle it. Oh, no need, sir. I've arranged for your bags to be delivered to the inn. <laughs> Are you by any chance, John and Isabella? That's cool. That's cool. I want to thank you, ladies and gentlemen, for watching and for all the new ones that's in uh, tuning into my game videos. I want to thank y'all for viewing my videos, and I will be bringing you some more Assassin's Creed 3. Thank you for joining me this, on this journey and adventure, and we're going to be exploring Boston very soon. So until then, we will see you all later, ladies and gentlemen.